She is Anel Flores, artist, writer, activist. She is the epitome painted red of me. And like so many others that are craving and yearning and screaming to be free, she was drowning in the desire to just simply be. Especially here as a resident in the land of the free, the home of the brave, Yet due to religious beliefs and cultural stigmas, many live safely in a cave where they must behave and take their truths to the grave. Often we choke on those very inhibitions. We feel alone, unaccepted, unvalidated, unloved, and unworthy in our creator-driven missions. We are told we can be whatever we want in this life, unless it is this or this, and especially this. We're told what we should look like, what we should think, how we should feel, to be an inclusive member of this society. Acceptable behavior or eccentric character traits that linger outside of the perfectly square little box will not be tolerated. She rebelled as a youth from all the turmoil displaced from trying to conceal her past and live in the present while wearing a mask, mainly from herself. She had to revisit the abuse, the hate, the scrutiny, and ultimately being outed and shunned by her own loved ones. She had to displace the negative connotations bestowed upon her that lingered within. It is easier to become your assailants than to stand up against the herds congregating with the intent to segregate and discriminate. But like a warrior, she prepares for battle. She loaded her arsenal with the weapons of mass destruction. She aimed to demolish the hate that is taught and passed on through the generations. She recognized that her plight went beyond her. Her goal was to heal, to include, to validate, to create, and like the phoenix that was consumed in its own raging inferno, she recreated herself. Her strength was ignited through gaining knowledge, art, creative writing, compassion, meditation, and gratitude. This catapulted her rise from the ashes. It was in that struggle where she obtained insight and gained an empathic nature. After the gloomy, dark storms, a rainbow full of color appears. And in Greek mythology, a rainbow symbolizes the path between heaven and earth. The Spanish translation of rainbow is Arco Eris. Eris is the goddess of rainbows, the messenger, as is she. And in radiant climes, she found purpose in her pain. Her message represents peace, hope, and liberation. She is inspiring, brave beyond measure, invigorating, in agreement that she is impeccable with her word, she is authentic. She is an asset to others being able to exist just as they are.